I'm showing you the pong game. Okay, we've got it where the ball can hit edges and bounce and hit the paddle and bounce. We need to let the user move the paddle with their finger at least to start. Okay, and in general, we need to you know I want to show you how to move a sprite um, with with the dragged event um, in App Inventor. Okay, so I've got my image sprite here and I, I'm in my blocks and the image sprite has a dragged event okay and this is when a user touches their finger down on the, on the screen and drags okay and this actually gets triggered a bunch of times each time the finger moves a little bit on the screen the dragged event, event happens and the start is like right where you put your finger down and then each time this gets triggered it tells you where you were and then where you are now and usually it's like a couple centimeters that you've moved or a couple pixels and and that's it okay so when the user drags on the sprite what we want to do is actually move the sprite okay and I'm going to use the move to operation you could also you know we just want to change the x coordinate so you could just set x and change the x coordinate of the sprite but I'm going to change it and I want to move my x-coordinate to right where the finger is, you know, right, right where the person has, the user has changed um, or moved their finger. Okay, so I'm going to grab current x, and that, that's what the, and, and, you know, I just want the y to stay the same. Okay, so I have to actually go to image sprite and grab the y property for a sprite. Um, because, you know, we're just going to let them move on the horizontal or the x-coordinate, but not on the y-coordinate. Okay, I've got my phone projecting on the screen. And you know what I'm going to do is is just touch my finger down, and I should be able to move the image sprite. And you'll see it as I get. It's a little choppy on your screen because my phone's projecting, um, but on my phone it's a smooth movement as I as I drag that guy. So anyway, that's how you drag any sprite or let the user drag any any sprite. This is a very common pattern, and that pretty much sets our pong game up. Let me see if I can play it. I'll click start and see if I can kind of play pong. All right. Um, obviously, there's some other interesting things you can do. You know, what we're going to do next is do the score, um, do some sound effects, and, and, and of course, you could also make it um, where the user can use like the orientation sensor or, or accelerometer to, to move the paddle.